Tonight, a pair of Fox News exclusives as we continue our coverage of the Russia collusion investigation, the Trump dossier, and the opposition research firm behind that. Chief Washington correspondent James Rosen has new information tonight on ties between the Justice Department and the people behind the Trump dossier, a connection that's really raising more questions tonight. Good evening, James. Brett, good evening. New disclosures confirmed to Fox News by top investigators on the House Intelligence Committee show that the link between Fusion GPS, the firm behind that anti-Trump dossier, and a top Justice Department official ran deeper than previously known. Fox News was the first to tell you last week about the abrupt demotion on Wednesday of Bruce Orr, the associate deputy attorney general who was stripped of that title and his fourth floor office at Maine Justice amid an ongoing investigation into his contacts with the two leading figures in the controversy over the dossier, meetings that DOJ officials told Fox News Orr had withheld from his superiors. House Intelligence Committee staff uncovered that Orr met last year with both Christopher Steele, the former British spy who authored the dossier with input from Russian sources, and that Orr also met last year with Glenn Simpson, the founder of Fusion GPS, the opposition research firm that paid Mr. Steele with funding from the Hillary Clinton campaign and the Democratic National Committee. Now Fox News has confirmed that Nellie Orr, an academic Russia expert and the wife of Bruce Orr, worked for Fusion GPS last year indeed was paid by the opposition research firm through the summer and fall of 2016, a timeline that places her on the company payroll around the time the dossier was funneled to the FBI and perhaps up through the election, some two weeks after which her husband met secretly with Glenn Simpson. The House Intelligence Committee Chairman Nunes told Fox News in a statement today is looking into all facets of the connections between the Department of Justice and Fusion GPS, including Mr. Orr, unquote. DOJ, which initially claimed that Bruce Orr had been stripped of his top-line duties because he was holding down two jobs at DOJ, and that was, quote, unusual, today had no comment about the revelation that Mrs. Orr worked for Fusion GPS last year. Brett. James, quickly, and I know we don't have these answers as this investigation continues, but, but how is it that the top of this investigation, uh, the people in the Department of Justice, could not have known that there was any of these ties for so long. Yeah, that's what they've told us, and if that's the case, it wouldn't speak well for them, but it almost defies belief that Bruce Orr, as he was meeting with uh, the, the principals behind Fusion GPS, wasn't creating some kind of paper trail to alert folks to what he was up to, but we expect to learn more about all of this as the weeks unfold. And we will follow it. Uh, James, thank you.